Welcome back to Let's Play the Brigmore Witches. The DLC chapter for Dishonored. There were two of them when I left. These dead eels are uh, really getting on my nerves with all their constant paranoia. So I took care of them. We're here in Draper's Ward to take care of a guy named Edgar something, who usurped the uh, command of the dead eels from our uh, temporary friend, Lizzie Stride. I don't know why I took a picture of that. Uh. Karnaka needs workers. Come to the edge of the world and experience the place of legend. It's very carefully worded to avoid saying it's a good, it's a nice place. None of those assholes have one of those. Quiet in the city. Almost like it used to be. I heard he was a cheat. Let me just a few. Get caught out when the dead eels come across the canal? No thanks. Every man for himself. I'm touched. A former merchant from Draper's Ward's better days, Jerome, now deals in black market and hard to find items in the safety of his apartment overlooking Millinery uh, Canal. Well, I'm dead broke, but I might have to look into that anyway. Simply because of, uh... Well, uh, the last time I ran into a guy like that, it was Griff in the, uh, main game. And he sold, uh, some very interesting things indeed. Most notably... Blueprints. I have just noticed that they put a hat on top of their uh, stolen arc pylon. Okay, that's going to be a problem. The shield is up. Which means I can't just do what the loading screen suggested and yank the, uh power core out. Ladies Fashions Ogdens. Handcrafted by Clarence Ogden. Okay, let's get the fuck away from there. For the time being. Oh right, I forgot to loot the bodies. I wasn't sure if he was missing an arm or if it was just clipping into the ground. Oh, there it is. I found it. Never mind. Found it. And it returns. Handy trick he has there. No pun intended. If you believe that. Where the fuck are the rats? Are they in here? No, what the fuck is that? Oh, it's just food. It's all good. Well, lacking any other idea what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. Let's murder some rats! Hey, he's not even deformed. Sorry, sir, you can have that back. Yeah, there you go. How in the world? There must be a basement underneath.
Oh. One of these. It's kind of disappointed there wasn't one of these in the last level. Like, Granny knew we were going to get invaded and go to give me a uh, challenge. The last level of the uh, Knife of Dunwall, I mean. Granny's Wedding Reception. A page torn from an old manuscript written in a scrawling hand. Bring a man to represent my black-eyed groom. Fetch a woman to represent me in my youth. Lay them together in the eternal circle. A wedding band to bind them, placed on the silver tray. Do this for me, dearie, and I'll give you a wedding gift. Granny. A dangerous experiment. Well, I should go see if that, uh... I haven't choked anyone out since those two uh, dead eels, so they should still be up there. Okay. Where am I going to find a wedding band, though? Here comes the bride, covered in tattoos. Eternal Circle. Here we go. This might kill them. That would be bad. Maybe I'll get lucky and they'll despawn before I can do anything about it. A dangerous experiment. I've come across some old writings that hinted a bizarre ritual, and I'm going to use it to prove to you once and for all that all this mystical stuff is just superstition. When I get back from my mission in the sewers, I'll do this. There's a trick. You need a bride. Ha! Near as I can tell, she doesn't need to be willing. She doesn't even need to be awake. By the outsider's eyes, I don't even think she needs to be alive. So you go secure a bride if you can, and I'll officiate this mock wedding. Oh, that was food. Machinery Repurposing Guide. Excerpt from Machinery Manual. 7. Re... Rejigger mounting and unmounting. Remove the cover over the primary gear and set it aside. Remove the primary gear and replace it with a secondary gear from the alternative drive system. Manufacture and place dual counterbalance weights along the alternate drive system axle and unlink the damping coils at both ends. Remove and set aside the slide arm from the rejigger support. Open the slide arm piston shaft and remove the pistons. Uh, reshape the slide arm pistons to the shorter specifications and reapply lubricant before closing the housing. Install the elongated slide arm into the rejigger support. Adjust the reverse spacer bolt at the junction between the alternative, sorry, the alternate drive system axle and the new elongated slide arm until the interval suits the new application. Oh my god, that was so boring. What? Oh. Battle of Dunwall. Hmm. Well, I guess I want that. No, no, there would be if, I, if there was a key behind that painting, I would be able to see it with my special eyes. Wait a minute. Ah, oh, it's no good. There's rat blood all over Mercy's grace. It really undermines the message. Ah, there you are, Jimmy. I've decided you're going to get married to that friend of yours. I know, I know. You're just friends. It would be awkward. But sorry, Jimmy, I'm fucking doing this.
Maybe there's a jewelry store or something. Yeah, no. Fuck are they going in such a hurry? Come and get me! Or won't your mommy let you? Just let him show his fate. You guys take orders from Trimble now, is that it? A nurse? You go to teat on him? Hatter! Now and forever! I'll cut you up like a slaughterhouse whale. You hear me? Are you missing something, little eel? Oh no, he was water soluble. That's what happens when you I wonder why they keep winning. I mean I don't care either way, really. I suppose it works out best in the long run for me because I'm trying to get my client the command of the dead eels back. But honestly, I don't really care which of them wins. I'm making a lot of noise right now. That was really, really weird. I don't think that was ever supposed to happen. Ah, there we go. Damn it, Dowd, what is with you? You're supposed to be a master at Blink. Is it called Blink when he does it? Yes. Just making sure. It's Dark Vision, I think called Dark Vision. Here we are. Ooh, some serious juju on this thing. Splintering bolts. And there's three corrupted charms in this area. Benefit. Bolts shot from your wrist bow do much more damage. Penalty. Bolts almost always break on contact on shot at enemies. Why would you bother? Since I hadn't done it in the previous level, I'm going to try summoning one of my dudes for a chat. I guess this seems stable enough. I don't have another thing, of course. When I was a kid, we joked about the geezer being a monster who could never die. The geezer is the, uh, the name the street gives to the mysterious old man who leads the uh, Hatters, in case you've forgotten. I once knew someone who drowned in the canal, just before the plague hit. They were lucky. When this is all over, perhaps we should stay with Stride and her ship. Our old hideout is no longer a secret. You have a point there, but I guess we're not going to do that, because that's where Corvo is going to find us. P.S. Spoilers. You should ask for a cut of the milk profits when we return. How can they refuse you? Oops. Oh, I hit L and it uh, immediately used a potion. Interesting. I've done some digging. It seems there's a connection between Lizzie and the geezer. So she's his daughter, obviously. There was a potion somewhere around here. The geezer seems to have a knack for turning a profit from an otherwise unfortunate set of circumstances. Where the 
I, I'm good. So, let's see. Any jewelry stores down here? Dude's name really is Mortimer M. Hat. That's incredible. Mortimer Hat's Fine Textiles. It's not Mortimer Hat's, it's Mortimer Hat's Fine Textiles. <laughs> Fuck you, man, I'm just taking pictures. What am I looking around for? Uh, that. Oh. Ow. You know what? I'll I'll take that. Oh, hey guys! I can't even see... Well, I don't want to be here anymore, so fuck you guys! Must have been rats. I had no hard feelings on trying to murder you guys earlier. I want no beef with the rats. I think these guys have a date with a dumpster. see the shape of the uh, safe, that means it really isn't locked. Hey, that's a good idea! That's down there anyway. been here sitting undisturbed for so long. It's got plants growing in it. 
And while yes, I know that's just an effect of uh, the things unfortunately clipping through the model, I'm going to interpret it to mean that you guys will have all the time in the world to sleep it off, so you won't be interrupted rudely by garbage men. Key required. Dick butt. Ox rush flower. Not until I know why I need it. I don't see any actual crust, just these pearls. Shut up. Warning from an anonymous friend. Hello, friend. As instructed by your whalers, I have dredged this horrid thing up from the depths of the storm drains and placed it in the agreed-upon location in hopes that you, and only you, recover it. But be warned, poor fortune has followed me every step of the way since laying hands on this thing, and I have overjoyed at the prospect of leaving it here and being done with it. May it treat you better than it has me, and if some unlucky local has stumbled upon this wicked bone, heed these two warnings. As I have said before, above, poor fortune will find you. But more importantly... This is intended for delivery to the most dangerous man in the Empire. If you are in possession of something he wants, you may count your remaining hours on one hand. Mmm, feels good. So I got upgrade this to grab people. Or I can keep saving up so that I can uh, get Ben time upgraded. That was really useful in the later stages of uh, the main game. So I think I'm going to go for that. To be honest, pull just seems like kind of a novelty. Okay, so Edgar's on the uh, riverfront. Still need to find a wedding ring. Where's this? I don't know where he would be. But the fact that I don't see him on these uh, points indicates that he's not in this area. Maybe I should check the textile mill, since he apparently now works for Mr. Hat. Man, I feel short right here. In any event, I'm burning dog face. Just a rock. And I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play the Brigmore Witches. The DLC chapter for Dishonored. When we continue our mission to take down Edgar Wakefield and get on with facing the break more witches. Later!